Group's video shows suffering at Iowa lawmakers' pig farm. Des Moines, Iowa, AP, an animal welfare group gained access to an Iowa state lawmaker's hog farm and has posted a video on the internet that shows pigs suffering and even dying in what appear to be inhumane conditions. Two people with direct action everywhere, a Berkeley, California-based group, entered a hog farm last spring owned by Republican Senator Ken Rosenboom and recorded disturbing conditions on video and in photos. Inside the barns, investigators documented months-old piglets suffering bloody rectal prolapses and intense overcrowding. They came across one piglet who was unable to stand, and gasped for air while thrashing wildly for several minutes, before eventually dying, the group said in a statement. Ken Rosenboom, who farms near Oskaloosa, said in a statement that he and his brother were surprised and disappointed to learn of the allegations. The pictures indicate careless animal husbandry practices that violate acceptable animal care protocols, the very protocols that our family has carefully followed during a lifetime of animal care, he said. What we saw in the pictures is not okay, and we took immediate steps to learn why this had occurred. Matt Johnson, one of those who entered the barn, said he submitted a complaint Thursday to the Iowa Department of Agriculture and Local Law Enforcement after seeing conditions in the barn, which he contends constitute criminal animal neglect under Iowa law. Johnson declined to name the person who accompanied him. Officials with the Department of Agriculture didn't immediately return calls seeking comment. The farm is operated by Rosewood Pork, a company owned by Rosenboom and his brother, Calvin Rosenboom. Johnson said he entered the barn on a night last April and entered through an unlocked door. The group delayed publicizing images so it couldn't be accused of contaminating the barn and hurting animals, as farmers have claimed after past investigations, Johnson said. Rosenboom said the barns were managed by another family under a lease in April so his family had no role in the management of the pigs at the time of the investigation. He said the pigs were sick then with a respiratory illness that caused unpleasant symptoms and even death. He said it was clear proper care protocols were not being followed and while the pictures show poor housekeeping he denied there's any evidence of cruelty, neglect or abuse. He also denied overcrowding. Rosenboom said his family began to take over management of the barns before they knew about the investigation, in part because of their own concerns. The barns are now under his family's direct supervision, Rosenboom said and he described them as bright and well ventilated with the temperature controlled to keep pigs comfortable. He said the pigs always have ample space. Fresh Fay for more on this story, visit the news article link.